everyone, Pastor Nathan here. In, in the book of Acts, one of the narratives we read, or one of the little vignettes that uh, Luke, the author of Acts, supplies is the, the narrative of how um, Timothy and Paul meet. Timothy is, ends up being Paul's son in the faith, but it doesn't start out that way. Um, most likely, Paul and Timothy meet on Paul's first journey through the area uh, where there's some towns like, uh, called Lystra and Derby. Paul suffers a great many different things. He has to overcome a great number of challenges. And how he overcomes those things, I believe, is critical to developing his relationship with Timothy. In, in fact, Paul, in one of his letters to Timothy, will say, Remember how I responded to the challenges uh, from a variety of sources when when we first met, essentially. It's a bit of a paraphrase. But the goal is, uh, the idea is pretty simple. How he responded to challenges laid the foundation, sowed the seeds of the gospel um, for Timothy and for their future relationship and his work, uh, Timothy's work in the church eventually. And I guess my point is this how we respond to challenges matters, whether that's a challenge at work, challenge of COVID-19, challenge at home, uh, challenges in our, in our own physical or mental or emotional health, how we respond to those things. Um, people are watching. And, and what we want to do is plant the seeds of the gospel with our response and then water them in how we continue to live so that God's work can come to fruition as God's work came to fruition in the life of Timothy, in part because of how Paul responded to challenges. I hope that's helpful for you today as you think about how you're, how you're responding to the stress, uh, the anxiety, and the, the challenge of COVID-19, and many more things that, are, that, that often plague our lives. Hope you have a great day in our Lord Jesus Christ, and we'll talk soon.